Yo, what is going on guys? In today's video, we are gonna be checking out Icadia RSPS for the very first time today And in today's video, I am gonna be giving away a $50 bond to you guys So to be entered in the giveaway, make sure to like the video, comment your in-game name, subscribe to my channel Turn on the post notifications, comment, join my personal Discord And also, add me on Snapchat, FBK Merc without space And that is all you guys have to do, good luck and I hope Hope you guys will enjoy the video. Let's get started. Alright, so we are gonna be checking out Ikadia RSPS for the very first time today. And this server is a 718 loading OSR Stata 685 models and using the 667 game frame dedicated to providing a fun mix between RS2 and also OSRS. I will leave the link for the server down below to the video description so you guys can come and check it out. So as you guys can see from the Discord of Icadia, you guys can also read about their events. And as you guys can see, Icadia is actually hosting crazy events with massive prizes, as you guys can see. So that is super dope. Have a look at that, for example, right over here. Icadia's bingo card, that is super dope, but yeah, you guys can read more about their events from their Discord. But boys, I'm actually gonna be starting up my today's video by showcasing the home to you guys, as you guys can see, here we do have some altars right over here, there is also a workbench right over here, where you guys can actually upgrade different items, etc, etc. Have a look at all the different cool items that they have, guys. Blood twisted bow, etc, etc. But boys, let's also check out the chains as you guys can see you can exchange items over here um, and yeah let's also move on let's see what else do they have there is also an Icadia's teleporter right over here you can teleport around with that bad boy as you guys can see bosses teleports wilderness bosses special bosses etc etc look at all these different bosses that they have then also cities dungeons as you guys can see then they have uh, mini games Yo, they have many mini games actually. Dominion, Dower, Best Control, Warrior Skilled, Fight Caves, Fight Killen, The Inferno, etc. etc. Also Clan, Citadel, and also Dice Zone. Then also PvP teleports, as you guys can see. Then also skilling and also training as well. So yes, there they do have the Icadia's teleporter right over here at home. And by the way, guys, have a look at all these cool you know, objects that they have, like, for example, the workbench, you know, that's how the teleporting thing looks like, there is a hand holding a fireball, like, that is super cool, boys, look at that, and then, boys, let's move on, what else do they have, there I can see a few thieving stalls, where you guys can drain a thieving, then they also have a tet right over here, you can also grab a task from him, then there are some more shops right over here, then a slayer portal, reaper chest, brimstone chest, etc, etc. Icadia's wishing well, as you guys can see. Yeah, that is super dope. And let's also check out North of Home as well. And there we also have a toxic chest right over here, a crystal chest. And as you guys can see, that is the gear that I am wearing right here, a dark set. A Dark Eater bow, etc, etc, and we also have a Legendary Wyrm following me as well. But as you guys can see, north of home, they do have some more shops right over here. So that is absolutely lovely, boys. And then there are also some shops east of home as well. Then there is a portal, a collector, a house portal even. So that is super dope, boys. And east of home, you can also mine some ore, strain some mining, etc. There are also some trees right over here as well, you guys can skill over here, so that is super dope. And yes boys, that is the center of home, they do have grand exchanges, and also banks right over here. But by the way guys, you guys can also open up the teleporting interface by clicking on the H right uh, down the minimap right over here, H, and yeah, you can teleport around just like that. And from the guest tab, you can also check out daily challenges, as you guys can see, global teleports, Titles Manager, have a look at that, Collection Logs, you can also check out Game Barracks, you can check out the Players Online, and much, much more, so that is super dope. And have a look at that, boys, in Icadia, they also have a Spiritual Tree as well, so that is super dope. Look at that, boys, it is right over here at home. And by the way, guys, they also have many future planned updates, for example, Chambers of Xeric, which is currently under development, then also Theater of Blood, which is also currently in development, and also Player-Owned Kingdoms, 
bank placeholders, then also a custom minigame called uh, Hive minigame, then also custom Elite Dungeon RS like custom CSGO minigame, more upgradable items through the workbench, more rune light as well as also OS body like settings, adding latest OS RS data and also general PvP updates and also content. So the owners of Icadia are working on the server all the time and yes boys there are many massive updates for you guys to wait for. A lot of cool content is currently under development. And by the way guys have a look at all these cool prayers that they have as well. They have affliction, desolation and also malevolence. That is super dope. And they also have a dedicated and also supportive staff team. They have a frequent updates. As I said, there are interfaces. As you guys saw, for example, the wishing well right over here is super dope. Then they also have lots of custom items and models trying to keep it as close to OSRS as well as also RS2 as possible. Then also potion timers, global buffs, wilderness resource, arena, enraged boss spawns, event bosses, instances, toxic chest, grand exchange, and much much more boys. They also have 5 game modes, 3 different XP modes as well as also 2 Iron Man modes as well as Ultimate Iron Man and also Group Iron Man is also coming soon. So let's for example check out some mini games that they have. They actually have the fight kiln. So let's quickly teleport there. Let's go and check it out boys. As you guys can see, there it is. Super dope. And then they also have the Inferno as well. So that is super nice boys, the inferno right over here, let's teleport there and let's also go and check it out. And as you guys can see, the inferno is now ready, so yeah, it is actually super cool to see an inferno working in this server as well. Look at that boys, and they also have different waves as well. So it won't only be the boss, they actually have a full inferno. So that is super super dope. And boys, then for example, they also have a dark demon. Somebody's already attacking it. Have a look at that, boys. There it is. That's how it looks like, level 672. Then let's see what else do they have. Burnt Arena, for example. Blink. Look at that, boys. Let's also go and check out Blink, for example. And there it is. Look at Blink right over there, boys. So... Yeah, they have a lot of cool content at Icadia. Alright guys, so we are gonna be opening up some Reaper Geese right over here. So let's see what we will get from this chest. And see if we can get any lucky boys. I'm gonna be opening up 40 of these bad boys. Yo, we actually got an uncut Onyx. I will take that. Let's see. Dragon Arrow, Dips, etc, etc. Let's keep it up just like that. And yes boys, we will do some nice openings at Icadia now. So that is gonna be some fun, boys. That is gonna be some fun time. So let's see. Then geese left right here. What else can we get, boys? What else can we get? Some SNGs. And yes, that's what we managed to get, boys. That's what we managed to get right over here. So let's also open up 20 Icadia mystery boxes. And see what we can get from these. As you guys can see, these are all the possible rewards that you can get from these. I actually won't open 20 of these because that would take too much time, but as you guys can see, we got an Abyssal Whip from the first one, and that's how these mystery boxes work. They actually have a nice spinning feature for these boxes, and yeah, the possible rewards are very, very choicy. So that's how the beautiful Icadia mystery boxes work like. Let's also open up some toxic mystery boxes, see what we can get from these. We can get a divine spirit shield, etc, etc. And yo, we actually got a dragon hunter lance from the first one. That's not bad at all, boys. Let's open up two more. Let's open up two more right over here and see what we will get, boys. Damn. Yeah, the arcane was actually pretty damn close, but we got a thorax set. So, let's open up one more right over here, but as you guys can see, they actually have many different cool boxes like that, that you guys can open, so that is super dope. And we also got a Verax set as well, boys. So, what else do we have? We also have some Vote Mystery boxes. Let's see what we can get from these. As you guys can see, you can get all these different supplies from the Vote Mystery boxes, so that's pretty damn dope, boys. And we actually got 5 mil cash from the first one. Let's open up one more right over here and see what we will get, boys. And we also got some red spider eggs. Okay, okay. And let's also quickly open up five toxic keys to see what we will get from these. And that's what we managed to get. I will actually 
Bring some more. Let's do that. All right, boys. 20 more toxic keys. Let's see what we will get. Some cooked caramb ones. Some supplies. That's what I like to see, boys. And let's see. Some seeds, rock tails, steel bars, etc, etc. That's what we got from the toxic chests. But alright boys, let's now go and head to the Icadias Discord and also check out some cool update logs as well as also sneak peeks. And I will also leave their Discord link down below to the video's description, so make sure to come and join Icadias Discord today. Alright boys, so we are now in the Discord of Icadia as you guys can see and let's also check out their updates logs. And as you guys can see, here are all the different updates that they have made. So if you join their Discord, you can keep a track of all the different things that they have done and that they have been working on. So have a look at that, boys. They actually have been working a lot on the server. Like, oh my god, bro, look at all of that. That is actually crazy, bro. Yeah, they have been working on the server for a long time. And as you guys can see... They have made a lot of changes and a lot of fixes, so that is super dope. Let's also check out Sneak Peeks, boys. There is a, a new thieving stall tables coming soon, uh, modeled by Rogers. Let's see what else, boys. That's their website, looking absolutely lovely. All right, all right, and also Redwood Logs, as you guys can see, Inferno, Banjo Nering, as you guys can see. Let's see what else do they have. Yeah, look at all these sexy models. These look super dope, in my opinion. That is the client, as you guys can see, the home area. Yeah, that is super dope. They actually have a lot of cool content in Icadia. Alchemical Hydra. Look at that, boys. Raids coming soon. Yeah, look at that King Black Dragon. What the hell, boys? Then some other bosses, as you guys can see. Teeter of Blood. Yeah, they have a lot of cool content in this server. So definitely, guys, come and join today with a link down below in the video's description. And all right, boys, I'm now going to be wrapping up my today's video right over here. Make sure to enter the massive $50 bond giveaway that we are hosting. And I hope to see you guys all online in this amazing RuneScape private server with a link down below. Once again, boys, thank you guys all for watching and peace out.